This event has been so important for the way that design needs to respond to the climate crisis. What the Design Council has managed to do is bring, you know, 100 people from across the UK and across the world to have a really amazingly curated conversation. Since the pandemic, we've all been so starved of new ideas and starved of that connection. So it's even more powerful now than I think it was before. I'm extremely excited to see organisations as powerful and influential as Design Council coming to the table when it comes to designing, not only for the planet, but also for a positive and regenerative future. I think events like these really kind of encompass everything we want, change, action, and I think ensuring that people who are at the forefront of the decisions being made about the climate, such so as designers and policy makers, actually know what people want, what young people want. There's a great opportunity ahead for design to really shape the future of net zero and net zero environments and accelerate us towards realising uh, a sustainable future. The risk is that we continue just talking about it and not doing uh, a lot about it. So I think from a legacy perspective, taking radical action, um, intentional action, but as soon as possible will be really important. We've got to get to the mainstream. We've got to get sustainability to be as cheap as not being sustainable and to be as easy as not being sustainable. That's what we've got to do. And we've got to do it in such a hurry. I think the future needs to be about learning from and with new kinds of people in new kinds of places uh, because that's where the, the, the real important changes are being made. We've had 120 of the leading sustainability designers joining us here in Dundee. We've had 5,300 online registrations, 28,000 views of all the different workshops and 50 of the most amazing speakers joining us from around the world. Design has been part of the problem. It has been part of what has brought us to the brink. There's no question that design has a critical role to play in getting us out of this situation. I think this is the time for design to shine.